Don't forget to subscribe to my channel and turn notifications on so that you can get the latest notification about my new tutorials. Hello and welcome to Fahad Likes Walkthrough Videos. Today we are going to talk about passive monitors and what's our goal. Passive monitors are monitors like syslog, windows event logs and SNMP traps. By default, windows event logs are enabled but are not captured in WhatsApp goal because we have not created monitors for that. But if you are willing to monitor any other, you need to enable passive monitor listeners over here for sys, uh, SNMP traps and syslogs you would need to enable. But Windows even log setting is already set to uh, listen it by default. So today we are going to look at how we can configure a passive monitor for Windows even logs for login failure. You need to make sure that audit and auditing is enabled from your uh, Windows side. You can do it through group policy or some other means. I have already enabled my Windows servers for auditing so that they can get failed login attempts and event logs. So to create a passive monitor, you would need to go to monitors. You will click on add sign and click on passive monitors. And then you will select Windows event logs. Okay. I would name this as Windows Login Failure. And for the type of events which I would like to capture, I can select all these options, but I would look for event ID because I know 4625 is the Windows uh, failure for login attempts. Um, if you want to confirm, you can come over here and you can see what kind of even log would be there if there is a failed login attempt. So you will see that the event ID is 4652 over here. So you can select more than one category. Maybe you would like to see a login failure attempts on particular machine. So you can uh, create another one and or all conditions again you can get on. And you can say that if the description is source is type is user is or computer is. So you can select any of these values over here. So but for now I'll go only with failed login attempts on any machines. I click OK. And then I'll save this monitor over here. Then, of course, I would need to apply this monitor on the required machines. So I'll select these both machines and I'll apply this monitor. All right. So now, as you can see that this passive monitor is also added um, to these two machines. And if you look over here in monitors, we have passive monitors activated for this one, these two machines. So let's do something. Let's go to the main controller and try to do some login failure attempts. All right, so now let's go back. And let's go to logs and we should have windows event logs over here and you can see I have login failure attempts over here and I can see the details of these events over here. So this is how you can capture login failure attempts through passive monitor and WhatsApp poll. We can talk about the thresholds also how we can set up the email notification or some kind of alerting mechanism for the attempts which are failed logins for a certain number of attempts in certain time period, but we are not going to cover it in this video. We will talk about it in different, different video tutorial where we are going to talk about thresholds. Thank you so much for watching for our next walkthrough videos. Please comment, subscribe to my channel, and let me know if you need to know more about any of the products I am talking about.